I still can't believe I had the opportunity to work with such a legend. Aguilera said Christina Aguilera is taking a trip down memory lane this Halloween. This year, the genie in a bottle star, 42, got all dressed up to pay homage to another singer with a huge impact. Tess and Ali forever, Aguilero captioned an Instagram reel on Monday, referencing her and Cher's characters in their 2010 film Burlesque. In the video, the Grammy winner lip-synced to audio of herself asking her co-star which dance routine she wanted to see. Cher, 77, replies, saying that she wanted to see Wagon Wheel Watusi. Dressed in a cheeky black bodysuit with chains and fishnet stockings, the voice Alan then grooved while posing in a photography studio in the behind-the-scenes content. The natural blonde switched up her style to don long black loose curls, similar to how Cher has been known to rock her hair. On my favorite day of the year it's only right to turn back time and tribute to your trailblazer at Cher, Aguilera began in a follow-up Instagram carousel that included images of the final result from the photo shoot. Cher's message through her music and style has left a permanent mark on the world and to this day, I still can't believe I had the opportunity to work with such a legend. The Lady Marmalade songstress changed up her outfits in the upload, also wearing a form-fitting strappy black floor-length dress and a sheer, blinged-out onesie. No one could ever fill the shoes of the great and powerful Cher. The love and respect I have for you is endless, Aguilera concluded. In the film, the beautiful artist plays a small-town singer named Alice Marilyn who leaves Iowa to chase her dreams in Los Angeles. Once there, she finds herself working as a cocktail server at the Burlesque Lounge, which is run by Cher's character Tess Scali. At the time, then-Screen Gems president Clint Culpepper opened up about wanting to get Cher back on the big screen for quite some time. She brings a soulfulness and gravitas to this character that will ground the story, Culpepper said in 2009. The only person who is more excited than I am is Christina. In a 2020 interview with Entertainment Weekly, the outlet caught up with some of the cast and crew a decade later as they reflected on the film. I had always been inspired by throwback classic pin-up art and burlesque style, essentially all things celebrating the female body and sexuality, so I was already versed in the history and appeal of this world, conceptually, Aguilera told the outlet. I wanted a modern take on burlesque with a retro feel and a nod to its history and origins, costume designer Michael Kaplan added. Naughtiness without being crass. There's a bit of the Crazy Horse Saloon in Paris, the musical Cabaret, as well as the 60s TV show Hullabaloo as well as the Follies Bourget.